Famous Autopsies Part 70, Janis Joplin. Janis Joplin was an undisputable star. There will never be another recording artist like her. She had such grit and soul behind her voice that it was as if you could feel every outstanding moment she experienced in her life. She performed at a music festival in 1967, and just like that, she was touring and had a huge fan base. She was just that good. In a tragic twist, she only had a few more years on this earth. In the fall of 1970, Joplin was finishing up her album Pearl in LA, which would go on to be her biggest yet. Sadly, she didn't get to enjoy the success. She was found dead inside of her hotel room. She had a small amount of bloody mucus in her mouth and two fresh hemorrhagic punctures on her left arm. Her arm also revealed healed puncture marks. She had a pink-tinged foam in her trachea, and her upper respiratory tract was moderately congested. Her lungs had edema or fluid buildup. Portions of her brain tissue was also congested, which means that there was an obstruction in blood flow prior to her death. Her liver showed fatty changes, which is abnormal at her age of 27 and could be a result of her substance use. Her death wasn't pinpointed until her toxicology results came back, which showed a lethal level of a substance I cannot name that starts with an H. Her death is classified as accidental.